Hello everybody, this is Toshiyagi from beautiful little island Okinawa, Japan. I'm a photographer. Um, this is my subject today. I shot it a long time ago when I was art school. Well, this image I processed the 120 film, which is analog age. Uh, I remember this film was underprocessed. That's why color is not not much saturated. Anyway, and I think I pushed print or something like that. I tried, I mean, uh, this is second or third time I tried to make image from this base image. And this time I want to make a more light uh, pop feeling kind of watercolor light um, light image. That's what I want to try from this. Well, we have this base image and also I make I made this line drawing type image by Adobe Photoshop. Use the filter called Find Edges. And I only got this finger edge and this shape of the this model's pose. But uh, some, well, I like the um, composition and stuff. So uh, kind of symmetric angle and a symmetry posing and nice background that's what I like about well let's get started okay, I'm gonna move this one down on here then I'm gonna turn on the well and just leave it here I'm gonna uh, paint it on this layer anyways um, I'm gonna go for watercolor wash flat brush then uh, I'm gonna put nice skin tone on her face. This lighting is side light, main light, so highest light is on her hand and uh, right hand side of the face is her face is a lighter and dark to here. So now it's going to a light side. Okay. I'm going to turn this one down maybe 30% or so. 30-40%. Okay. Now I'm going to use the size of the brushes. Not that big. We'll settle. Very we see it. I'm gonna put some on here too. No, but I wanna see the shadow too. So I'm gonna add this but dry layer first, then make it a little bit smaller size. Put some more middle tone in highlight area. And I have a shadow here, but uh, well, let's put the shadow a little bit dark image. Okay, go for shadow now. And this is a little bit big. Okay, now I'm going to blend in. Can you guys see this oozing image? That's the coolest thing I would say. I like this on this fresco. Uh, 
I'm gonna add layer, then draw the, her eyes and lips, then change the watercolor brush, basic watercolor, real, real small. I don't see much. Draw the eyelashes. And here you don't see much, but it's kind of dark here. And now I'm gonna go some eyebrow. dark side so I don't see much. I guess that's about it for this and now so it's not well interesting lipsticks I mean a lip color I go with it. There is a highlight here I have dark area. Okay, now change the brush to uh, one detail. Then make it some different color on. Well, I'm gonna march down. No, not now. I'm gonna touch up the skin tone first. No, dry then. Her hair before that, I'm gonna brush down this face to other colors in here. Okay, I'm gonna go a little bit bigger, light side of the hair, kind of orange look, real light. Same orange, but to more. Yellow, brownish, around this tone around here. That's too dark. More color in it. Hmm, okay, that's nice. We have some texture. Okay, I'm gonna make it smaller, add more water to blend in this. Okay, pretty much done for her face. Little shadow. Now I go with the yes, costume. Okay, I'm gonna add layer for costume. Now I'm gonna go with Use a brush to watercolor wash flat. Go 
with the light side first. Now go more dark. But I want to uh, give some texture from dark side maybe. Now I go for background. Okay, I'm gonna go outlines with this watercolor round detail. Let's go outline first. Smaller size. Like the yellow. With a watercolor brush, wash flat, real big one. Let's see now. I'm going to turn down. I'm going to add some water to blend. A little bit more dark. Okay, that's it for background, and uh, I go with uh, 
No, I forgot the necklace here. Rear dog image, okay. I go with the red. Real strong color. Same watercolor, round detail. On this layer. No, it's really light side. No water, less water. Okay, now I'm gonna make create empty mask, then I re invert mask. Now I'm gonna reveal on this. Okay, let's use flat dry. That's what I'm gonna try today to reveal this image. here. I'm s some hide here because I want to see the texture of the watercolor image. Then now reveal with smaller size. Okay, I guess that's about it for today. Well guys, thank you for watching my video. I really appreciate to support me and uh, you guys have a nice day and see you next time. Bye now. Ciao.